Have you ever pondered the intriguing overlaps between South Africa and Zimbabwe? Today, we delve into the fascinating commonalities these two African nations share. Our first point of similarity is geographical location. Both South Africa and Zimbabwe are situated in the southern region of the African continent. They share a border that spans hundreds of miles, fostering a strong sense of interconnectedness. Moving on, we find another common thread in their shared colonial history. Both nations were colonized by the British, which has left an indelible imprint on their societal structures, language, and cultural norms. English remains one of the official languages in both countries, a testament to their shared historical narrative. Next up is the similarity in their economic structures. Both South Africa and Zimbabwe have economies heavily reliant on mining and agriculture. They are rich in mineral resources such as gold, platinum and diamonds and their fertile lands yield bountiful agricultural produce. Our fourth point of convergence is their diverse wildlife. The national parks in both South Africa and Zimbabwe are home to a spectacular array of fauna, including the renowned Big Five, the lion, leopard, rhinoceros, elephant and Cape buffalo. Lastly, we cannot ignore the cultural similarities. The Shona and Ndebele people, originally from Zimbabwe, also form significant communities in South Africa, contributing to a shared cultural tapestry. So, to recap, South Africa and Zimbabwe share geographical proximity and a common border. They've both been shaped by British colonial rule and continue to bear its linguistic and cultural imprints. Their economies are both anchored in mining and agriculture and they are blessed with a rich and diverse wildlife. Lastly, there's a shared cultural heritage, with communities like the Shona and Ndebele straddling both nations. This exploration of similarities between South Africa and Zimbabwe only scratches the surface. Each of these points could be a deep dive unto itself, serving as a reminder of how histories intertwine and cultures overlap in this interconnected world. So. The next time you think of South Africa and Zimbabwe, remember, they are more than just neighboring countries. They are nations linked by shared experiences, economies and cultures.